Slave City family, what is up? It is Bobby. I'm about to go into the world's coldest Trader Joe. So I brought my sweatshirt here, grandpa style, and do a shop along video for the best things to buy at Trader Joe's in the summer. I'm talking about summer snacks, hot dogs, sausages, drinks to keep you cool and hydrated. Uh, so let's go in there. Do what we always do, show you what to buy, what to avoid, and how to read the ingredients before you actually buy it and take it home to your family. But before we go in there, I do want you to check out thrivemarket.com using my promo link down below. You guys know I love Thrive. They're a seven year supporter of the channel, but the reason why I like them is pretty much anything you would get at any grocery store is on Thrive Market, but it's cheaper. They also have two of my favorite things right now, a plant-based milk called Kiki Milk and Seven Sunday Cereal. Put the two together, they're unbelievable. Even better, my link down below gets you 30% off your first order, a free gift, and it's 30 days risk-free, and the box of the food comes to your house. You don't have to go to the store. So try them out, you will love them. Less talking, more shopping. Let's go into Trader Joe's. Let's talk grilling and chilling for the summer on the wall o meats here. You wanna go straight to this section right here. Two beautiful Bobby approved hot dogs. Hot dogs are normally mystery meat, what I call lips and buttholes, but Trader Joe's brand. Organic, 100% grass-fed beef hot dogs, or the old Stammy Buy, Applegate, 100% grass-fed beef hot dogs. Why do I love these? Because it's not mystery meat. It's pasture-raised, grass-fed beef. And do you see cruddy ingredients in the other ingredients? No, you don't see sugar natural flavors, any bogus ingredients. This is what you wanna see. It's clean as can be. It's $6.99 for 12 ounces. The Applegate is $5.99 for 10 ounces. So basically the same price, good to go. Toss it on the grill, yummy, yummy. If we come down here, we look at sausages for the grill and you're gonna to wanna to go organic, otherwise you're talking about GMO meat. And I would go with this, organic sweet Italian chicken sausage, $6.99 for the pack. And just like the beef sausages, these are clean as can be, organic, non-GMO chicken, no sugar, no mystery ingredients, no filler ingredients, all thriller, zero filler, $6.99 sold. Now we were just looking, Leilani and I, for the grass-fed beef. I was telling her that even though it's Bobby approved, I don't like the texture here. I've said it before, it's kind of like stringy and weird. It's gone. But you look at the grass-fed beef steaks here. Does anyone think this looks appealing? So this is the grass-fed ribeye. A ribeye is supposed to be streaked with marbling. That marbling is fat. I don't see any marbling at all here. The color's a bit off here, so I don't know what the deal is. Leilani with the, with the Trader Joe's. Things that make you go, hmm, grass-fed beef. I would stay away, stick with the sausages. This is the place you wanna live for summer hydration. I'll talk about these, two of my favorite, but Leilani and I just saw this, and this is literally defining water and melon. Where's water? water? Melon. melon, there it is. It's cold-pressed watermelon, but if you give it a shake, it looks much better. Watermelon juice got popular a couple years ago. It's cold pressed watermelon juice with a little bit of lemon juice. Very, very refreshing. Just keep in mind, there's no added sugar, but the natural sugar is quite high here. It's 32 grams, very refreshing. What I love with a passion is this and this. This is their version of like Thai coconut water, a harmless harvest. And just like uh, Robert De Niro and um, Meet the Parents, Jack Talk Thai, Jack Talk Thai very well. This is really good pink. Um, water that's not high heat pasteurized, it's high pressure pasteurized, so there's more living nutrients. But what I love better is this. Leilani, have you tried this before? I actually have never tried uh, either of these. Crack, crack this one open and try it right now on camera. This is amazing. This is the water that we just talked about with coconut meat. So what's great about it, it's refreshing. If Oh my God. Right? If I know Leilani, it tastes crazy. And by the way, mm. for those of you who don't know Leilani, she helps a lot with Instagram and other videos. You don't see her too much on YouTube, but here <laughs> yeah. she is. Hi, Leilani. <laughs> My debut drink. Yeah, that's right. Your debut, <laughs> drinking the best drink ever because when you blend up like the it. coconut water with the coconut meat, it's so refreshing. And what lives in the coconut meat? Medium chain triglycerides. If what, you could feel this on your tongue, oh, it's so silky. It's so silky. <laughs> and what lives in the coconut water? Natural electrolytes. So it's the perfect drink for the summer. I love it. It's $2.29. Take it to the beach, take it to the pool. You're good with that. You're good with the watermelon juice. So you're at Trader Joe's and you want to get sunscreen before you go to the beach. Well, which one do you choose? Both are technically not Bobby approved, but in my opinion, you don't want this one because if you read the ingredients on the back, 
something we talked about in a recent personal care video. You see the active ingredients? These are chemical-based ones like avobenzone and hamosylate. Chemical-based ones are the bad ones. They actually absorb into your skin and can be found in your body weeks later, and the inactive ingredients are no bueno either. So you put that back, and they have the mineral sunscreen here, but unfortunately it's in the spray bottle. That being said, I'd rather you buy this one than the other one. The only reason I don't like spray, it's not as effective as the uh, lotion and the spray uses a chemical propellant to get it out of the bottle. It's really bad for you to inhale, especially for the kids. That being said, it's still better than the chemical based one. What I would do is um, go on Thrive Market, the Bobby approved brands are on there for great prices. Badger is fantastic. The Thrive Market brand mineral sunscreen is a great price and it's one of the best ones for the summer. Also, in terms of food, just added to Thrive Market was my favorite paleo cereal, Seven Sundays, and it's a great deal. You pair that with my favorite non-dairy milk that's only available on Thrive Market called Kiki Milk. We eat that on the couch for dessert. We just finished season two of Tehran on Apple TV. That was a great dessert of choice, fantastic. So grab the sunscreens, grab the seven sundaes, grab the Kiki Milk. Thrive Market has the best prices. When you click my link down below, it's 30% off your first order, a free gift and 30 days risk-free. So check it out, you will love this stuff. And I'll put a list of all my Thrive Market favorites in the description box down below. Sometimes it's the easiest stuff that wow people. I just went like this and Leilani's like, what? She didn't know these drawers open. I huh? walked by this so many There you go, Leila. There you go. So the drawers <laughs> open, and living in here is a great snack for the summer. I talked about it a long time ago. These are called fruise balls. I wouldn't expect a peanut butter and jelly snack to be Bobby approved, but look at these ingredients. It's date based with peanuts, coconut, apple juice, strawberry puree, elderberry juice. Now, I do wish the strawberries were organic and they use real Himalayan pink salt here for this kind of snack without any added sugars or oils. It's very, very high quality. And for $1.99, grab a couple bags, take them to the beach on road trips. I just wouldn't get the chocolate one because I have natural flavors and you would know that because they read the ingredients or scan it with the Bobby approved app. Go for peanut butter and jelly and don't be afraid to open and close that door like Leilani will now too. <laughs> Tucked behind these onion chips that are not Bobby approved are these. This is a really cool brand and it's very nice to see it at Trader Joe's. Let's say you're making a summer barbecue and you want beans, Mexican cowboy pinto beans. These guys usually have great ingredients, but what I love is the beans are cooked in avocado oil, non-processed, non-inflammatory, heart-healthy avocado oil. And look at this, it's just really good seasonings, really good flavorings, no filler ingredients. They make a lot of cool products, but I've never seen it at uh, Trader Joe's before. $2.49, you take some of that maybe, you take some of the grass-fed hot dogs, Franken beans, Bobby approved, come on. The family needs snacks in the summer and over by Leilani. I'd say this is probably the most Bobby approved snack here for summertime. So not only is it organic, non-GMO popcorn. Look at the oil, Leilani. Not just olive oil, it's extra virgin olive oil. It's organic too. Yeah. It doesn't matter that it's organic necessarily, but what I love about the fact that it's organic or extra virgin, not just regular olive oil, is that it's cold processed. It's not heated to the next step of uh, the processing stage called olive oil. I like extra virgin, the fact they put it on popcorn, which is usually pretty cruddy. That's great. And you can get a bag for $2.29. So that's great. And then we've talked about this many times, but this would be another great choice. It's potato chips. It's not cooked in extra virgin. It's cooked in olive oil, which is still decent, but it's way better than any other chip cooked in processed, let me see what, canola or safflower? Sun, sunflower. Boom, sunflower, pick another one, canola, no go. Yep. Go with this one, go with the popcorn, you're good to go. All right, family, Leilani and I are done at Trader Joe's, although you have to go back in and get the lavender, yes. uh, lavender, lavender tree, plants. she said it's good for? Um, Bugs. Bugs. The bugs away. There you go. I have a lot of mosquitoes. Perfect. And they have an uh, aloe plant in there too, which is yeah. good for sunscreen. Aloe uh, or aloe? I don't know. How do we say it? I say aloe. I don't know. It's good for how sunburns. Do, do... <laughs> <laughs> Leave a comment down below. That's it. We're out of here. Check out thrivemarket.com. Use the promo link down below. Get that cereal. Get the Kiki it's Milk. So get the 30% off your first order using my link down below. But from Trader Joe's, Leilani and I leave you like we always do. Hashtag keep on cooking. Mad love and peace. Later. <laughs> <laughs> Nailed it. Nailed it. <laughs> <laughs>